Up next, a boyfriend won't stop telling me I have B.O. I have been with my boyfriend. <laughs> oh my <God. laughs> I know. I made sure I put on deodorant today, too. I was like, God, I can't be like OP here. I've been with my boyfriend for over a year, and everything has been great except for one thing. Every single day, at least once, he will tell me that I stink and smell of B.O. When we met, I showered every day, applied regular deodorant in the morning, brush my teeth three times a day. Now I am so paranoid about smelling bad that I shower at least twice a day. I apply new industrial strength deodorant every few hours. I have a reminder on my phone. Perfume, and I brush my teeth every time I eat or drink something that isn't water. I feel like I'm going crazy. I didn't think I smelled bad in the beginning, and I don't think I smell bad now. But I obviously smell bad to him, right? I'm that weirdo that keeps sneakily smelling my own armpits. I've been to the doctor and he has said there's nothing medically wrong. It has honestly gotten to the point where I literally shove my armpit in friends and family's faces asking if I smell bad. They all say I don't smell like BO at all. One friend even said I smelled too clean, like a lush store. I'm getting so paranoid he won't cuddle or anything when he says I smell. I really don't know what more I can do. Um, don't do anything. Break up with him. Oh, this that's is so that's, sad. That's some psychological mind game stuff. That's, yeah, that's not like there's two. There's two, in my mind, there's two directions that this could go. And like, either he has truly like the worst sense of humor. He has like what I call little brother humor, where it's like the least funny joke, but they keep saying it over and over again. Like maybe, maybe it's that, in which case you're a sick fuck buddy, like, please move <laughs> on. Or, but more likely this is some, I'm not trying to be like overdramatic. This is like trying to keep someone under your thumb. This is a method of control. Um, and it's psychological warfare and it's deeply unkind. Mm -hmm. And the, the thing is like her friends, her family would have said something. The fact that she's been to the doctor. He gaslit her so hard. He, she went to yeah, the doctor. Yeah. That's, that's, nasty and so mean and like to make someone feel I had a really really awful boyfriend who I don't even talk to my followers about that much but he would do stuff like that you know he would just say he would say things like over and over again he would be like well you're not that cool you know you're not well you're not that cool like kind of over and over again and at first I thought it was a joke and then it kind of like started getting in my head and I was like is that true about me or he you know he would just say things like I don't like this at all. To well, me, what's the like when people do stuff like this and what you went through? Like, what's the fucking point? Do you even like me? Why are you with me then? It's it's a method of control. That's what's the scary thing. It's 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 yeah. chipping away at someone because if you say something enough to someone, even if it's completely untrue, she's a human being. Mm -hmm. You know, she's gonna start to get paranoid, and that's what's so nasty. Like, I think that that's really mean, and I I think he sounds like a terrible person, and I think she should dump him. So you're right on the money. There's an update on this oh, one. Oh, there is? Oh, my God. So, update. I waited for him to make a comment this morning so I could talk to him. It was less than an hour after waking up, and he said, quote, God, you stink. I had already showered and put on deodorant. I snapped and asked what exactly was he smelling because at this point, I'm one of the cleanest people on the planet, and if I still smell bad to him, then we should just break up. He got all panicked and upset. I eventually got out of him that this is what his father always said to his mother. Apparently, his father told him that it was a surefire technique to have women never leave you because, quote, she will feel too low to cheat, will love only you, and will always be clean. Needless to say, his father is wrong. He's packing his things and moving out of my house today. I... I wanted to be very careful about this word that I used before, but now that I say it, I do want to say that that's psychological abuse. Absolutely. And that is so disgusting. And I am, wow, I'm so happy that she broke up with him. Thank what God. What a nasty man. What a nasty, and I hope that that father knows that he is awful. The and poor mom. I'm To deal with that? I'm, that's heartbreaking. And like, so mean. I feel bad for him. Like the top comment on this, holy shit, that update. His father basically groomed him to be an yeah. emotional abuser. Yeah. What? Horrific. Absolutely. I hope that that boy Just gets so some sad. therapy and tries to 
unlearn what his awful father taught him. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm glad that that girl is free of of that nasty, nasty. Thank God. Abuse. Thank fucking God. 